Welcome. In this video clip, I would like to talk about what you can possibly expect during a session. I cannot give you any specifics, meaning I cannot tell you what exactly will happen for you. Not even if I knew what your problem was. My intention is to give you a brief insight in what to expect, or sort of, in a nutshell, explain what really a session is all about. It's really important to understand that reconnective healing is a demystified process, meaning it has nothing to do with the rituals. When you come to me, first of all, we will uh, talk about any questions. And I also have um, a questionnaire which I will ask you to fill out just in order to get some information, not about your problem, but just about your person and to later use to document anything that you've experienced, any sensations or other uh, inputs you may have had during a session. I will not ask you what your problem may be or why you came to me. This is not important because as I've mentioned in another video, reconnective healing is not about fighting or eliminating symptoms. It is about healing the entire person on all the different levels. So once we have talked about any questions at all regarding this session, you're invited to lay on a massage table on your back and close your eyes. It is advised to just lay there and observe. Eric Pearl says it in a beautiful way. Observe or be the observer and become the observed. And this is really the best way to put it. What does that mean? Well, it means that you do not add anything, that you don't try to breathe in a certain way, that you don't try to hold any intentions or direct the frequencies or hold any visuals or God knows what, but that you just rest assured that whatever needs to happen will take place during a session. The session on a massage table lasts 30 minutes, though I always plan 60 minutes for any session so that we have enough time and you don't feel rushed. Once the 30 minutes are over, you're welcome to sit up or have a seat in the chair and I will then ask you what you've experienced. I will document it on a piece of paper, not to later interpret it, not to tell you what that means, but just simply so that you can gain awareness of what happened on a different level. That's what it's all about. After the first session, it's completely up to you whether you want to book a second or third session and it's also up to you how long you want to wait till you book your second or third session. The rule of thumb is that if you have received what you were looking for after the first session, you can leave it at that. If you're not quite satisfied, you may book a session the next day, after two weeks, after two months, after two years. It's fully up to you. The benefits will stay with you. So it is, again, vastly different than anything that you've probably known or experienced so far because it's fully up to you to decide when you come back and there's no disadvantage to waiting two months or more. I really hope that I have given you an insight in what to expect during a session. Again, if there's any questions at all that I have not addressed or that you would like to have answered, please feel free to contact me by email or call me if you'd like and I'll be happy to answer any of your questions.